I would like to. I would like to um, stow my lands, pull out my sling, and um, plus one. Let's go. Plus one rocks. Let's go. And, uh, yeah. This is not very fun. There's only been one. I think there needs to be some encouragement. So it would be a 10 plus 5. Are you giving me a check in the air? Nice pointy rock. Join soccer. Yeah, I like to do it again. Um, sure. Just a Sling again then. More rocks. Oh, wow. Um, so that'd be 23. Oh, gosh. Yeah, even for your shield, that would still hit me. So, yeah, that hits. A pointy rock. Yeah. Right in the face. Oh, and the arm is surprising my plus one, so it'd be 24. He looks around, and you all hear him. Either you start killing each other, or I'm going to start killing you. Oh, okay, valid. Might be better go upstairs. So, that is mission 20. Next up, Scott, you're up. That makes sense. He's probably not. Chicken. It was right there. You're going to pay for that. It's two copper pieces. It's two copper pieces. Are you, are you, oh no. Faster than you can see, Scott, a chicken is suddenly banished from the board. Mm -hmm. What? what? <laughs> nope, it's just gone. Okay. Are chicken? Nice line sucking. So I'm going to move over and check out these crowds. Okay. Uh, they're glowing brightly. How many are there? Just the two piles of runes. But I mean, like. It's like a whole bunch of rooms. They're mostly on the interior where you're seeing, and there's a little gem in there that's really glowing bright now. Let's go for it. Let's see what happens when I touch the gem. Is that an action? Um, if you want to interact or mess with it, that'll be an action then. So. Roll me a arcana check. See if you can kind of figure out what to do when you touch it, or see what happens when you touch it. That is a whole seven. No, that's a five. I want to go back and Ooh, shiny rock. Oh, choice. <laughs> So that's Mild explosion. <laughs> so you touch it, and a magical energy just rushes through the whole ruins. Um, I need you to make a strength saving throw really fast. Um, oh yeah, because you're proficient. In that. Um, you are thankfully you feel having you. Grab the onto the run as hard as you can as you feel gravity reverse. <laughs> I removed the one I And it happens, you seem to see over there too, a pulse of light. And all the loose things and stuff seems to fly 15 feet up into the air. So, that was your action. <laughs> you almost launched yourself into the air. But just the, do I see the ruins well, both? Geyser. Yes, and all loose objects within up to the tower's edge and about out to this bar. So, are the chickens okay? The chickens are fine. There's yeah, only the one left. left. <laughs> yes, there's only one chicken left, sadly. But it, and it the, looks like he's about to eat. eat the dwarf well. is okay. The followers okay. Everything seems to be fine. Nothing else was close enough to really be affected by that. Okay. But I'm still like under this. You're, you're still under. Nope, it's over. Oh, it happens in. Instantaneous. Oh, Proud of you as a ver for just a moment. Uh, I think I'm using movement action. So, so you have a bonus action. This kind of like glass vial, and it seems to be radiating this like heat. And in it is this kind of like burning fire. Um, you find a potion of fire breath. <laughs> potion of fire breath. <laughs> and the chest, fire breath. 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 And the chest, 
closes, and then you hear. Uh, well, from the one that you just opened, and then the other two, because the other one's gone. Got it. So the chest actually just pooped away. Yeah. Okay. The other two are in the corners are still there. Um, you get the sense that you would only be able to open one. Right. Okay. So then, uh, I don't. I'm not familiar with how the potions of breath work. I'm, I know there's a time limit. Yeah. So what <coughs> exactly are the so, uh, yesterday. Is it um, like I drink it and it's one shot? Or? Yeah, it's it's a kind of like like a breath weapon for a dragonborn. You just kind of. Okay. Yeah. And can there be a delay between when I drink the potion and use it, or do I have to use it? Okay. I'm sorry. No, that's fine. Uh, it's fine. Some nights are fine. Uh, it is uh, consumed as a bonus action and then it's the same turn. Use it. Same turn. Yeah. Okay. I will. Okay. Let's see. Do I have any movement left? Um, the, 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 so, you just check. Uh, I'd say you only have about five feet left. Okay. Um, in that case, I'm just going to make sure I am not. I'll move into the corner where the chest I picked was, so I'm as much out of line of sight okay. uh, from the hole as possible for now. And then <clears throat> that will be my turn, I believe. Yep. Okay, Agra, it's your turn. Let's start the secrets again. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Oh no. <laughs> Yes. Is that your turn, then? That's my turn. Alrighty. Uh, I think it's a roll from my stuff. Uh, 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 I can read that over and over. I still read it. I mean, I watch the guys go off. I'm not paying attention to that there anymore. So, just gonna go over the middle. Yep. Oh, that's really good. Basically, we're Barbarian from this window here, probably right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Where is he? Uh, right right should be able to. Yeah. Move over. Actually, I think I can just angle myself and get a clear shot that way. Yeah, I think you just gotta like. Because it's not, you don't have to actually move like in that five feet. Move just as far as that. Yeah. Get a clear shot. <sighs> Alright, maybe if I try describing how I'm doing, I'll actually be able to see it. Sure. Alright, so raising the crossbow up, uh, rushing one of my clawed talons over the ice rune. Try uh, blowing a bolt of frost energy and 14 plus 6, so does a 20 hit. Ooh, Finally! Okay, <laughs> she hits! She does it! Finally! Alright, 2d8. What did you get? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should just walk away now. <laughs> oh, no. Would you like to use hip Yeah, really. Is it, uh, are there any added to that? Uh, it's, so it's cold and your speed is reduced by 10 feet. Yeah. Uh, and then yeah. one turn. Yeah. How much damage was it? Uh, it was two damage. Two. You don't add anything? I don't think so. It was a spell. Okay, gotcha. Unless I should be adding it, I'd love to do more than two damage. <laughs> Alright, anything else for you? Nope, that's everything. Alright, back to the top of the round. This is getting messy over here. Uh, nope, no one has come. <laughs> Whatever spell you are using is wasted if it was a spell slot, otherwise it's a cantrip. Okay, so I feel like I would do an investigation check on them. Like, is that That would be an action user investigation check, but based on your passive, you can tell that the magic on them is just to let you open one chest and as soon as you open one of them, the other thing. Okay, cool. Um, I guess my turn is over then, but I'm just kind of like in that little corner, excited to open a chest. <laughs> Sounds good, I just can't play. Um, you notice this guy casts some spells. So, one more, so it's And starts moving really lightly on his feet. <laughs> Uh, what? Okay. <laughs> 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 
Mike, then he will look at both of you and say, Last one. <laughs> Start fighting or I'm going to help. <laughs> so that's what he does. Strike is not fun. If, if it lands, it is not fun. And then whenever my... This isn't one I pay for, open hand technique. I'm going to... Are the crenellations are high enough if I were to do the push back effect, mm -hmm. it would not push him over. No, no. they okay. kind of like, they're kind of up through like the here. Uh, <laughs> gotcha, it would just, back. okay. Get a good chiropractor. <laughs> right, I will do the fall prone effect, it's a DC 14 dexterity. Oh, okay. Dexterity, it's a roll d20, uh, dexterity saving throw. Okay. Plus one, 15. 15. 15. by one again. Well done, sir. All right. Well. And that is my, Not my first rodeo. Okay. Agro, you've just been punched, attempted to be stunned, attempted to be pushed prone, um, and there is a, a monk standing in front of you. What would you like to do? <laughs> Leap over the ball. Okay. Cast Ooh. feather fall. Okay. Oh. You, will, you will get an attack of opportunity because you're leaving his uh, okay. melee range, so you can okay. make an attack. I'm going to let that ride. That was a critical one. All right. So you attempt to like punch the sorcerer and you fly over. Oh, not fly over, but you jump over and cast Featherfall on yourself and you begin just gliding down, landing ever so elegantly and softly on the <laughs> snow below. Just a little crunch. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so you right here. Down. Yes. Alrighty. And I'm gonna put myself up against the wall. Alright. Try to cover f b vertically. Okay. Um, <laughs> roll a d20 as well for your other spell. Um, I don't want to do that. Okay, cool. Fair enough. Gotcha. Da -da -da -da. That would take us to trip. Nice. Go for. Oh, no. That's your third fail. That's my it's third fail. <laughs> and your heart. <laughs> and you unfortunately fall to the elements of the land. you so you're such a young 11. 11, so that's two successes and <laughs> one fail. Um, Gunther. Yes, sir. Your turn. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Sorry, I was nervous about this before. Okay. I mean, I don't. So all three floors floating down would be one, because it would be from the top to this one ten, and then yeah. another ten. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that would be twenty, and then. Okay, so I'm gonna go down the levitator and run out, run out this door, <laughs> and try and like I run out like back and forth, see him, and then. I'll all right. Yeah. Uh, you okay. see this tiefling like <laughs> pressed up against the wall. Um, and you get to make two or three. Girl, again, uh, non natural 20. All right, that'll, that'll hit. No, I don't think you have any answer. You do not. 14. Plus 6 is 14. You're right, Sam. Yeah, I don't know if that might No, it does. It does. 14. So they both hit. Okay. So we're going to be down. It's going to be 9 bludgeons and 9 more bludgeons. 18 total. 18 total. For that, for the for my two additional yeah. attacks. So, I'm going to I am going to. I don't know if you need to do anything else. I just oh. went unconscious. Is that unconscious? Okay. So you. You get attacked twice. In two strikes, you kind of knock the sorcerer flat on its ass. You kind of skitter into the snow, and you fall unconscious, <laughs> declaring. The winner. The winner. Congratulations. And expeditiously, I might add. The monk as the winner. Wow. Nice. Nice. Sorry, Jesse. Well played, guys. I hope that was fun. Sunday. Sunday is the finale. Sunday. 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 The winners of each table. I went in the fountain, yeah, check okay. it out, yeah. came back up. Invisibility is quite a fun spell when you are okay. in the Battle Royale. Yeah, I was going to see the uh, much more uh, scared character that moves 65 feet into my area, <laughs> and I'm like, whoa, okay. 
let's, 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 that's, this is true, this is true. But I'm gonna head towards the sigil again. Um, and I can climb up another 15 feet. Yep, so let's bring you over here now on the roof. Okay. Stay in here. You don't know where the bird is. I'm gonna... The bird is still invisible. The bird is still invisible. It goes 30, 35. And I'd like to try... I am uh, very agile and athletic. I'm wondering if I can climb up on top of... Oh, yeah, for sure. It'll cost... Um, It'll cost you 10 feet of movement though, so you've got 20, 30, 35. You can get onto the little problems, okay. not the upper one. So you're precariously standing on the oh, edge. Oh, do of it, the man! It's not. It's it's so much to live. I am so athletic, like, this is nothing to me. This, I'm, I'm just like, whatever. I'm just being a wonder beyond the scary land. Oh, God! Oh, God! Yes. Burn down! Burn down! Burn down. Burn down. I won! Oh, shit. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> That does not stick in. That is like now. Okay. So you're on the ledge. You are. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go into uh, dodge. Take the dodge action. Okay. Yep. And end my turn. Okay. Sounds good. Well, back to the top of the round then. Really, you're up. You can, but passively you can tell uh, what would happen if I were to do it. It might repel you a bit. Do any damage? Or just, it just depends on how far you fall. Okay. Um, I'm going to drop 30 feet down for my movement. Mm -hmm. That puts you down now at 50 feet from here then. Um, uh, did that investigation check actually No, that's count? passive. Okay. That's just your pass. Yeah, I get this shit going. Um, I'm going to use my action cast uh, Armor of Shadows, which is mage armor, basically. Okay. That so, will re remove my invisibility. So, you now see... A bird person flying in the air above. A bit. I then am also going to, for my bonus action, use Tentacle of the Deep. Okay. So I can summon it within 60 feet. Mm -hmm. um, and I can also make an action. <laughs> it is a Tentacle of the Deep. It is a spectral tentacle that strikes at your foes. Um, Perfect. And I'm going to swing at you with it because on its summoning, I get to attack with it. Roll the hit. 13 plus 6, 19. 19 does hit. It is 1 D8. So 5 feet 8, and then my spell casting modifier plus 3. 11 points of damage. 11 and cold damage, and your speed is reduced to 10. Okay. And my turn. Okay. Uh, keep oh, that by the way, I do yell out rude. <laughs> <laughs> rude. <laughs> rude. <laughs> I do yell out rude. Hey, rude. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, yes, yeah, Tumi, you are up. The like dwarf is looking at you, expecting you to do something. I'm gonna say, Rogar's saying to the dwarf, don't worry, honey, I'm gonna give you something to uh, be entertained by. So, I head to the middle and I wanna go up another floor. You see that he could easily attack you if he wanted to, and does not. That's a real, that's a real guy. Okay. Um, so that is 5, 15, you've used 20 feet of movement so far. Excellent. I would like Do you have a pair which one you want to go to? I forgot something. Uh, yeah, I'll just go like the one that has the Hold best on. angle for fighting. I'm sure that's good. Uh, yes, that one. I think just like right there is fine. Okay, so you're good to go. Is that within the range of the weird? Oh, I had, I, I is that within the range? It has a 10 foot range. So it does not look like you can reach you. Okay. I'm going to. Blast. 
not these. What do you got? I can and see him, right? Yeah. Yes, he is visible now. Is he, he, does he have dodge on? Or no? You don't know. I don't know. But you can attack at him, and I'll, I'll tell you to have advantage disadvantage. Okay, I'm going to use my Firebolt cantrip, because it has a very big range. Yes, you can definitely hit him with Firebolt. I'm going to hit him with Firebolt. Okay, roll the attack. Roll a d20, and add to that spell that's a modifier on the cross sheet. Okay, that seven. Definitely yeah. Okay, I hit him, yay. Um, before you tell me your modifier, lucky die instead of two. But, I mean, I'll take that. Oh, my spot is there. I'm at 21. <laughs> Lucky feet, I'm gonna have her reroll that 17. Because she didn't tell me the plus modifier. Yeah. What are you talking about? Oh, you just cut me off one before thing? I yeah, You're good. Um, you so, my feet. <laughs> Remember how we all get feet? I took Lucky. I'm going to blow. I get to choose three times. Mine or somebody else's. It has to be calm before you say plus whatever. But you told me you could cut me off. I have to. I have to cut me off. It's, it's like that. Who knows? No. Okay, so roll, roll another 20 and you get to pick which one. Oh, I get to pick which one. So she has 17. I picked that one. I wonder why. I wonder why. I get three of those per one. Well, wow. you marked that one off. That was one use. But that was a bonus action? No, no fireball. Fireball is an action. And yes. Okay. So now for my bonus, I'm just gonna hit make a dodge. A bonus, I dodge is a full action. Okay. Um, then I switch here. Okay. Then we come to the board. And then she has twenty. I'm gonna have So what you see, Scott, a giant phase spider leaps out of the spot, grabs this chicken, and goes back into the hole. Oh, gosh. <laughs> that one's stealth roll was not good enough. So that's what happened. There's danger right there, by the way. A what? There's danger there. Danger. So after that, um, we'll just move up. He's going to just chill.